Okay, I'm going to be showing you how to get half bite loader on your PSP for version 6.37 on your PSP. Now, this works. I just, I'm going to show you how to do this. It's on version 6.37 official firmware. It, it, you can run homebrew applications and emulators. And I'm going to show you I do not have custom firmware. See right there, version 6.37. Now that's the memory stick blank, nothing on it. The memory stick that in is the one I use all the time. Now as you saw, I had half byte loader. So now let's go ahead and turn this PSP off. Uh, let me say. See there's the file that I had to email you because I don't know a download link because I had it emailed to me. So there's the file right there that I'll have email I'll had to get sent to you but yeah okay so let's turn the PSP off say so here's the memory stick that has the half byte letter already on it there's the memory stick that doesn't so let's put it that one in the PSP. Okay, now let's hook it up via USB. Okay. Now I'm going to show you I have nothing on this memory stick before I even start to this video. Now as you can see it's a whole different memory stick. No games. Okay, yeah. Okay, now let's go to the computer. Okay, as you can see, there's all the normal files. So I have everything packed into this folder right here. Okay, now see this game folder? It's also inside of a PSP folder, like the main folder right there. So you're going to click on that. Let's go. This is the main PSP game. Gonna drag the entire HBL folder. Okay. Now back. Back. Now there's a lowercase HBL right here. It's got all that. Okay, sorry, this USB cable is not top of the line and it's not moving fast. Okay, as you can see, there's the HBO folder. Now, let me just, now I got to see this HBN folder. Or HBN file, sorry. Gonna need that. Now, when you get this, you'll have that license folder right there, or this license file. You will not need the license file at all. So, just don't even worry about that. Just, you can might as well just delete it, but I decided to keep it. I keep everything. Okay, now let's close out this folder. There's the HBL and HBN file. PSP. Game. As you can see, there's the file and everything. Okay, now let's go back to the PSP. Okay. There we go, there's HBL. Now there's nothing on this PSP, I don't have any emulators. As you saw, this was a brand new memory stick. Or, never used memory stick, I've had it for a while. Now when you first start it, you'll get a little screen like that. Well, you'll get this every single time, don't think that's screwing you over. Now, to, as you saw that HBL folder I had, the, um, you'll go to the menu folder, 
let me show you. This is how you can change the background, but this is the default one that's on now. Okay, now you'll go to HBL, go to menu, res, and see these pictures that are all in here? D delete them if you want, don't like them, like that one I don't really like yet. I saw I kept that one, but you just delete them, and then you go ahead and add whatever pictures you want, like that Modern Warfare 2 picture that I have on mine. I don't know if I, sh I got to show you that. But yeah, so that's how you change it, and here's half fight loader. Now, circle is like X, and X is like back. That, that's only in the emulators, but when you're just sitting here, like, pressing buttons, X is normal. But when you're in a game or emulator, it's always back reverse. Let's see? Say data system theme. Now, one more time to show you that I didn't just expertly edit this video to make it look weird or different. Because I'm pretty good at editing videos. Six point thirty seven official firmware. So thanks for watching our video. Please subscribe to our channel and more and better videos will be coming. So I'm very soon I'm getting my good camera back. And I'm you know, I'm gonna try to get that program that lets you record your PSP. I'm gonna try to get it back. So thanks a lot and if you want to do this and get half by utter and be able to run homebrew emulators and all this stuff it, private message me your email and I'll send you this PSP 6.37 half byte loader exe file for you to use and thanks and bye guys